grep is a powerful command in Linux used to search. It can search inside of files or even search streams that are piped into the command. Let's just take a look at a few of the basic uses. So to start with, we type grep and then the search term. In this case, we're going to search source code files for the word version. So the location of the files that we want to search is in var www matilda directory. And let's just say we wanted to search a particular file. So I'm going to search, in this case, inside of a file called constants.php. This is probably the simplest case. And it did not find the word version. But what if we were to do a case insensitive search, meaning we don't care if it's capitalized or sentence case or whatever. We add the dash I option, ignore case. Now we see that the word version isn't there. It just happens to be capitalized in some cases. And then there's one that, that is sentence cased. Next, let's try to search inside of all the files inside of that directory. So it's the same command as before, but in this case, we'll use the asterisk to represent all files inside of the includes directory. And there are actually other files that contain the word version as well. Some are lowercase, sentence case, and uppercase. And because of the dash I, we were able to recover all of those. Now, what if we wanted to search inside of the includes directory, but the includes directory contained other directories in addition to having other files. We can add the dash R option, which means to recurse. And so it'll cause grep to not only search the includes folder, but if there's folders inside of that folder, it'll jump down into those folders and so on. And you'll notice that we had mixed that with the dash I option. It's no problem to mix the various features together. Now, what if you have a list of words that you want to search for? Well, we can do this too. So I've got a couple of words inside of a file called version. It has status and version inside of it. So going back to our previous option, we'll keep the dash R and the dash I, but instead of searching for the word version, we're going to use our file that has the words in it and that's temp version. But to tell grep that this is a file and not a phrase to search for, we need to add the dash F option. So now we'll search for status and version inside of the directory recursively. And you notice that we found the word status sentence cased and the word version as we did before and various examples of those. So hopefully you'll find these various ways to search quick and easy and add the grep command into your arsenal of commands that you use in Linux.